and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, it's going to be all about fingers and toes. Yes, I call it the mom hack, call it a beauty hack, call it whatever you want. It's literally what I do for my super busy lifestyle. Like I'm a mom, I work from home, um, I run a household, you know, blah, blah, blah. The list goes on of what me as Wonder Woman does, right? And <laughs> So I don't have time to go to the salon to go get my nails done all the time. I don't have time to go do my roots. I don't have time to go get my hair cut, whatever. I just don't have the time. And honestly, like I don't make it a priority. So therefore it's not in there because I have so much else going on. So basically I just want to show you guys what I've kind of learned and the things that I do to give me that salon look, to give me that professionally managed pedicure, manicure, whatever it is I've learned that's really cut down and minimalized on my time, but to still get the same effect or the feeling that I get when I go to salon. Yeah, you're not gonna get the full fledged like, oh, I just got pampered for two hours or however long it takes for them to do your pedicure and your manicure. But you're still gonna have that end result. I can't tell you how many times I get complimented. I get people asking me, where do you get your nails done? How'd you do that? And like 99% of the time, I'm like, hey, I do them myself. Yeah, there's a couple times where I will take that extra block of time and go, hey, I'm going to the salon and I'm gonna do this and this. But 99.9% per <laughs> of the time, I'm doing it myself. So that's what I wanna do. I wanna share that with you guys because I know a lot of you out there don't have the time or don't make it a priority because you have so much else going on. A trick that's inexpensive, not time consuming, and there's multiple ways you can do it. And here I'm gonna show you one of my main ways that I've grasped onto and that I'm currently doing for my toes and nails. So, hey, let's get started and I'll show you some hands and feet. The two products that I'm gonna be showing you guys today, obviously one's for my hands, one's for my feet, um, fingernails, toenails, whatever. Uh, I'm not really going to be, I mean, I guess it's a product review because it's a product that I use and I love, um, but I'm really not going to go into too much detail on the actual product, but I will have it linked below. So if you guys are interested, check it out, subscribe to my video channel, my videos, my channel whatever share my video subscribe to my channel there you go I am gonna start with my feet first every time I know I'm gonna be doing my toes and my fingernails I always start with my toes um, just because it makes it easier especially if I'm going to be doing a long nail on my fingers whatever no I did not beautify my toes with the toe rings I always have toe rings I've had toe rings since I was in high school and nope I don't ever take them off start with my toes I use the dashing diva gloss ultra shine gel strips these are super cool. I love them. Um, they're really, really nice. They're super easy to apply and they give you that salon finish. And this particular one, I mean, it's super cute. It's got all these different ones to choose from. I also really like to use these because there's no dry time, which is really awesome for when you're running around with kids or work or whatever you're doing. So for my busy lifestyle, these work perfectly because I can get them done and throw on shoes if I need to and be out the door. Last thing that I wanna point out with these is they say they last up to 14 days, which is really cool. But when I wear them on my toes, honestly, they last so much longer. I mean, I'm actually changing them out and pulling them off before they are even starting to peel. So now I'm just going to go through and figure out what I want to do. It comes with 34 strips in this particular package and it comes with the nail file which has two separate sides for applying. So 
gone through, made sure my feet are clean. They're all good to go, but I did not use any lotions or oils because you don't want to use any for about an hour before, like if you're going to do this or after because you want it to not be able to peel off or slip off. So these are just dry, clean, good to go. I used my toenail clippers and I already cut them. And then I used my cuticle, I think this is a cuticle tool. And you just come around, cleaned up all my cuticles, pushed those back. And then of course I used my handy dandy nail file to file with my pinky first and then to grab like I'm gonna go in with this I know which one I want to use that one I actually have one of these tools go in with this wooden tool it has a sharp end and a flat end or I have this clear tool again flat end and a sharp end I use the tool, I use the sharp end to peel up this. Hopefully you guys can see this. But I will use it to peel up because it is sticky. And then I'll flip it to the flat end and I'll just get the very tip of it to peel it off. And I will apply it. To my pinky in the center. And then what you're going to do is you're going to fold it down and you're just pressing. And then I'm using it to press it down. And I actually use this to like help me guide over my nail so I can feel my nail. And just make sure that it's pressed down. Then you're gonna take your white side and I'm just gonna be following the line of my nail. Now that I have it all pressed down, I have it folded. Just clip off the excess. And just like that, and that you can throw away. And for me when I'm doing my toes, because I have a pattern, I will now go in and do my pinky on my left side. And I'm applying it right to my line.
Now I have my six toes done, and then now I'm going to do my four accent toes. I've prepped, I've done my filing, cut my cuticles, washed my hands, made sure they were clean, no lotion, no oil, so I can apply my nails. Use the Kiss Brand Salon Manicure Nails. I love these. Um, this one is actually a vivid two coat color, but they really do look like professional, like I got a professional manicure. And I love that they have different lengths. They have multiple colors, um, different styles you can get. These ones just happen to be the square and they're short. So it always will tell you up here at the top what length they are. They have just so many options. It's a really well-made brand. Now that I have these, I'm gonna go ahead and open them. And the first thing I do, I take them out so these ones are really cool too it comes with a glue and let's see. I dump everything out get it going and the first thing I'm going to do is go through and measure so I can find out the perfect fit for me it does come with the file and then those that little wooden tool that I showed you <clears throat> before they it does come with one of those which is awesome and then your glue and it does come with adhesives I never use them so yeah I just use the file and the wooden tool Okay, so now we're just going to go through and I'm going to sazz them. And these ones are really cool too because they do have at the tips here. I don't know if the camera is going to catch it. It does have the number just in case. So let's go and size up. I have the sizes matched up and I know which ones I'm gonna put on. I've already, like I said, cleaned up my nails. They're good to go. No lotion, no oil, nothing. And I'll even take some um, nail polish remover and run it over my nails so that my nail beds are ready to go. I'll take this little wooden tool 
and I'll even push my cuticles back even more just before. So I've already, like I said, cleaned up my nails. They're good to go. No lotion, no oil, nothing. And I'll even take some, now that I have them done, I'm going to take the darker side of the nail file and I'm just going to lightly go over the nail I'm going to do. Now I always start <laughs> with my pinkies. So you're going to see how I do them just because like it's not so bad that because these are actually short but <clears throat> I just got in this practice because it's the easiest way I've learned to apply these nails and you literally I'm just taking my file and just scruffing it up just a little bit and that way it gives the glue and the nail something just a little better to stay on and I actually take because this is like rounded and it's perfect so I kind of just make sure I'm getting to where I got like pretty close to where my cuticles are just a little bit so you can just see just a scruffed up just a little bit and I'm going to take my glue and I like to do a generous amount now I know they say just put it like a little bit little dots here and there I don't even know if you can see that but I honestly I will do the entire nail like be generous not overpowering but just enough to coat it and then get that on there and then I hold it and press and press and press and I like to rock it just because I think that gives it we'll see and then I have it on and then I'll take the other side just get that down just a little and there you have it and then sometimes um, it'll catch right here so I'll use this tool the sharp edge and I will push it down and then now I will actually go to this side and do this pinky And then I'm going to alternate throughout the entire process for the rest of it. So I'm going to go here, and then I'm going to go here, and then I'll go to my middle finger on this side, my middle finger, index, index, and then thumbs. And I just find that this makes it a lot easier other than doing one whole hand and then the other. So let's get these nails done.
And that is it guys, that is my routine, that is what I'm doing to get my nails and toes done and make it look like I just got out of the salon. So, you know, when you don't have time or if you're on a budget, this is a really good way. Um, I have linked in the comments below um, the gel strips that I use on my toes and then I also have the Kiss brand nails that I use on my nails today so these are the two things try to match because i'm one who's got to be matchy matchy sometimes so i always try to get colors that complement each other so even though these weren't sold together like the colors really complement them of course i tried to get as up close with the camera as i could so you guys could see but that's just me like you can mix and match and do whatever you want and these strips um, like I said, they come with different, like some of them you can get where it's all just one um, color if you want, or they have the ones now that they are making for the toes. But then again, if you have some small nail beds like I do, these are perfect, they work. And then you also saw my little technique where I actually used one strip and I was able to do two of my toes. That is my current routine for what I'm doing for my toes and nails when I can't get my butt into the salon or have time, whatever your case may be, whether you're on a budget, you don't have time, or you have a special occasion. This technique is a great way to get through that and can't express how many times I've had people just be like, where do you get your nails done? I'm like, aisle seven. <laughs> As always guys, thank you for watching and don't forget to comment, like, share, and subscribe to my channel and I will see you on the next video. Bye. Tell me pretty lies, look me in the face, tell me that you love me.